What I'd like to show you today is how you can use your USB headset to record audio commentary right on top of the gameplay footage you're capturing from your games console with your LGP Lite. So you can save the time it would take in post-processing to record a separate audio track, copy to your computer and mix it in. Don't be fooled by the audio jacks on the side of the LGP Lite, they're just for audio pass-through. To add live commentary we need to use a USB headset plugged into our computer. Also it's super important to remember that we're only using our USB headset to record our commentary, we're not using it to listen to the real game audio. In fact you just can't do that because of the delay as the ReCentral software processes the feed. Just have the USB headset hanging around your neck with the mic in a suitable position and use the sound from your TV for the gameplay. Next, fire up the ReCentral software. We want to go into the settings by clicking the advanced button, then ticking the microphone box and selecting your USB headset from the drop down menu. Make sure always on is ticked, but not the save as separate MP3 file unless you want to do post processing on the audio separately. Click the settings button and slide the capture device down to minus five and add the microphone at 100. Click ready and we can fire up our console. Before you hit record, make sure you mute the audio on your laptop and don't have the audio from your TV too loud as it will start to bleed across into the audio your headset is recording and it could make your commentary too quiet. In this example, I'm capturing gameplay footage from an Xbox 360, but remember that a PS4 can only output audio to either HDMI to your TV or to your headset so make sure that in this case you're using the HDMI option otherwise you won't get any game audio in your captured video file. Now we can start playing hit record on ReCentral and capture our gameplay footage and our audio commentary at the same time. Simple and fast and it's okay quality too if you've got a half decent microphone. You will need to do some post-processing on the whole thing though, the whole video and audio because I find the audio tends to be far too quiet from the ReCentral. Um, so I take it into Premiere Pro, but you could use Movie Maker or any other video editing program, and then I amplify the audio track to taste. Okay, so that's enough from me. Please put your questions in the comments down below. Hit like if you enjoyed the video, and subscribe if you'd like to see more of the same. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you again soon.